Hi and welcome once again to our show, The Late Night Miniatures. We are continuing today with our great Romans as they parade uh, down the, the Roman roads. And we have some heads here to assemble. I have managed to find three heads. So we have one head on the loose somewhere. I hope the cat didn't eat that one. Ah, oh, here it is. Great. So, as we do this, we use our uh, rather poor equipment. And we are chopping this off and chopping this one off. Then we go like a bit of... Uh, with the scalper here, as you see. Now this is good. Yes. Now the mole lines are rather good, so we are continuing putting in stuff that are done here. We have three more heads to do, and then we are done. I will make uh, I will make some uh, yerba mate to drink, and I will get back to you right away. Okay, I'm back and I have uh, brewed some yerba mate. Mm. That's nice. So, we continuing our journey to the uh, to the f older part of the that just let the sound here uh, do the control of bit here. Okay, so we are venturing further into the history of uh, the Roman Empire. Uh, sadly, it uh, broke apart, and uh, yeah, because if not, I think we all gonna be uh, talking uh, Italian. Uh, so now uh, I will get uh, into some of the uh, units that uh, were used during the or in the uh, Roman Empire armies from cavalry to uh, infantry, light infantry, uh, slingers, or was it slingers a bit earlier in the... I think the ballista was very popular, like penetrating uh, some men, like seven or something, or maybe more or less. Anyway, so... Now, I think I am done with the heads. What did you find? So, we take a glue. And assemble and assemble them a little. So, uh, what are we going to start with? Or we start to maybe with the heads? Yes, maybe the heads is a good idea. Or do we put the heads last? Now, let's do the uh, the heads. The heads gonna. Well, we wait with the heads because uh, if we put the heads, then we don't really know the. Uh, uh, like uh, direction on which one where they're heading. Now, one interesting part is how these guys hold the shields. There was a handle, not a stripe, but a handle, which meant that it didn't lie like this. All right, they're more like holding it outwards. I don't know if you see this. Well, this one is upside down, so that's gonna stop right. So we, I think we could start with the shields, all right? That will give us some uh, uh, angle uh, in where we can put the uh, uh, the uh, the uh, javelin later, or spears, or palum, or whatever it's called. Uh, yes, and we have a bit more more lines here, and uh, we will see. Uh, how this works out. I think they look coming up really nice. Of course with some color on it that would be great. And we will start painting our stuff maybe next time. Uh, tomorrow that is. And uh, after that. Now let's do this glue thing. So we take a shield. We put a little bit of glue in here. Maybe we can zoom in a bit as well. Up the other way. No, you will see it that much better now. A bit of glue. Not too much. And then we will put them here. Ah, this is nice. 
let's uh, hold this down for a bit so that uh, we could uh, uh, I don't know if it is upside nah they're very symmetrical so this one is holding his shield that's good let's put him here so you can see while he's drying now we take this one they have rather the same pose Oh, a bit different at the back knee here. A bit different here. Some are uh, uh, having a rather uh, straight leg. Some of them have a small bend. But otherwise, the, uh, the formation is uh, rather the same. And of course, there was legions and there was a very cohesive unit when they moved. So it's not a wonder that they're very similar in the experience. So we have the, this shield as well, too. we can glue this one on this chap and put it in the lower part over here. So, and the javelin line upwards, yeah. Now what you could do is uh, make the angle a bit different, all right? So they don't look like monopose fi uh, figures. Oh, this is good. Oh, this is a great line of of uh, combat or combatly men, men at combat or men at arms. No, no, they don't. No, no men at arms. They were regular soldiers. So we put this one as here as well and wait for it to dry. Well, at least uh, so it will. Have it will catch the glue as a set firm. So, yeah, this looks really good. We can tilt this one a little backwards a little bit. Ah, perfect. Uh, and now the last shield. After that, we will go with the, with the uh, arm holding the spear. Yes. So this one could be, uh, I think he will be totally uh, tilted like this. Huh? Let's see, this egg's great. They have really like this move, uh, this feeling of movement in them. So which one did I glue first? This one, all right? Now we could wait a bit for, for it to be dry. Nah, let's uh, let's do this one as. Uh, Cost and this one could cost right, so I'm pairing up the the arms. Which one? This is a casting arm as well. Oh my, a stabbing one. Now this is what I mean with the uh, with the heads. Because they are not throwing it forward in this direction. They're more throwing it in that direction. So let's assemble this one and see what happens. Well, this is fun when you make like gluing new uh, miniatures. Is that you uh, are you getting a feel for what's really happening here? The poses and uh, this is what I like with gluing hands and uh, stuff together. Now you you see this this. This is good. This is real good. Now he's just missing a head. A lot of movement here. That's nice. Compared to the orcs. No, not, that, not so much tilted backwards. Okay. And this one then. What should we do about him? Mm, he could be like... Uh, like this, you see it, like this, yeah, yeah, that's, that's good, now, uh, let's see uh, if we could, okay, which one was it, was it this one, no, it was this one, Look at 
that's that's a real nice huh painting this one's awesome so we have two and then we have this one and this okay this one will throw as well or prepare to throw or Uh, be, uh, before you glue this one on one on this one when you see a bit movement you can like try yourself to watch how the elbow goes all right because you can put it at here but this will go how much backwards you can tilt the arm and then we at the, at the end we put in the uh, Oh, 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 okay, now I think I'm a, a bit too far. Put it down a little bit. Like this. Because you, you must remember that you are not, with, with a thumb, you cannot really turn. It's in a really unnatural way to stand. Okay, so that's three. Awesome. Okay, still a bit movement on the shields. And uh, I think uh, these are for a more skirmish like game. But I think you could like put them up in the in the line. Okay, where do uh, where do you have it? Here you are. There are different kinds of games. This is for 28 millimeters, okay? So uh, you could be like having these in a formation on square basis uh, or, or you could like skirmish them but uh, and then maybe put them on 20 millimeters uh, square basis or uh, because I think 25 is a bit too big for these uh, sized one now this one is more uh, straightened out I see yeah. it's like really moving and if you can see where your angle is at your elbow so you don't mess up the autonomy of the of the person maybe put it up a little bit up the uh, above its head can we do it Okay, that looks awesome. Okay, let's like mix them up a bit. Huh? Yes, they look really nice from here. Oh, my camera is oh, like this. Huh? Okay. Now we have the heads, four of them. So let's try to fit them in. Now they have positioned at this, these shields rather uh, close to the uh, neck. I don't know if they hold it so close because if you be like uh, hit at it, it will th like thrust into your neck and in the line of battle it could go really bad. So we are putting in some heads and making room oh <laughs> look at this one oh, he's really hiding behind his shield huh oh, I will... yeah great miniature great sculpting I think that's that's awesome here see no oh, there you are let's take another head and uh, glue it together and see what uh, this one this could be like a more shy guy no i think this is kind of uh, well done as well Here, look at this awesome 
And you can really feel the, the tension lines of battle. Huh? Good. Good, 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 good. Uh, uh, this one. Uh, putting a small head. Now, the good thing with these uh, are that uh, they have this uh, nozzle or whatever you call it, the apply of this part. It's a very, very small hole in it and it, it allows you to make a little drop. You see? So let's use this drop on the other head because the, uh, the drying time of this is uh, it's some minutes. And this, as I said before, this glue. Oh, this one is the yellow one. Oh, oh, he's real pissed here. He don't like this. He been having his uh, galuccia or, or or pizza or calzone or whatever kind of food they, they eat. I, you see this anger in his face? Okay, this is gonna be like very impossible to paint, but anyway. Now, that, that's kind of stupid to hide his face behind the shield. So let's take this one that doesn't... Yeah. That good looks good. You see the movement in there, guys? Really nice, done. And we can do... Uh, let's take a look. Trying to... Put these... Uh, look upwards a bit but not too much because then the angle of the head is going to be strange strange something like this yeah uh, nice now this is good 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 nice 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 bravo Hooray, our legion! Yeah, now, I um, wonder if you could like paint them. Uh. Now, this one, these models are more fragile than the like the mono, mono uh, fix. And I have smaller parts, so keep them away from children. Uh, anyway, everything, uh, every child beneath like seven years old shouldn't even look at them. Uh, but they can try to assemble them okay well i seen a bit like uh, movies on the internet and uh, well like five years old painting but it's rather hard for them because they don't have the coordination of it and it could be like ending up in a frustration because you can't paint eyes and like ruin all the fun with it so um, uh, so let them grow in a bit all right uh and remember that uh, ever uh, when you have a child it's uh, like uh, Growing up, it grows up in different speed. It evaluates uh, its uh, motoric uh, uh, abilities different. So a five-year-old isn't the same as a five-year-old other one. But this is great. These went uh, will go. Uh, I think this will be my first Hall of Fame, guys. Actually. Because I can feel the forest in the, in Germania, or if this is maybe earlier or later. Uh, so all right, these are done with them. So let's take a short little break and get back to something uh, maybe similar or not. We'll see. So hi, back. Nice to see you, my dear friends. That's great. Um, now, let's see here. Uh, we are going to talk about some Asian, ancient Greek. Yes, the Hopolites or Copolites or whatever. So this is the spur that I got with uh, a free example of with uh, uh, Illustrated Wargamer, Wargamer Illustrated. Uh, now, when I first took a look at this, I was, wow, cool, we got some banners. Okay, where do we have those banners? Uh, here, oh, this is nice, this is banners, great. Then I look at the rod, and then I said, hmm, let me take a closer look on the back. Ah, there is a circular form of this. 
which, which means that are on the shields and then just hit me of course is the easier protection a thick cloth hanging down from the shield protecting your legs like in if, if you are in the front rank or something and then I went to check it up on uh, Warlord's page and yes I was right so nice thinking of me here uh, it's great so we're gonna look closer at these guys uh, we have uh, uh, someone with uh, armor on the legs some with no, no armor on the leg um, and these guys upside down maybe in China ah there they are and uh, we have some helmets and we have the classical uh, 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 horse-tailed uh, uh, Spartan-like uh, decoration on the helmets so this could be real fights and of course we have the classic uh, ancient Greek uh, helmets there as well uh, Brad Pitt, uh, we can call him Brad Pitt, yes uh, that's nice uh, so uh, we're gonna look at this but I don't uh, know if we have really the time to uh, to make uh, to do them now I see I'm missing a head two heads oh bollocks one two three there's some open helmets maybe they were like earlier or later like this is one two this head fell out oh oh well I think I will have enough. Oh, this is like this. Uh, this is this is uh, he's this uh, 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 three hundred uh, uh, Elidus or whatever he's called, Elidin or or whatever, Elidus or yeah, the Greek one. The Greek was rather nice. I think uh, the whole idea of uh, uh, philosophy and uh, and lots of. Uh, well, we have the Olympics from them. so I think they are really unappreciated because they really did much for our of development uh, as human beings. Uh, Socrates and all of the other guys, uh, and they of course the gods, Achilles, uh, Hercules, and stuff. So that was uh, nice. Oh, we have a sword. We can do this uh, champion here if you look. Yes, it would be great. Uh, I will make some research and what which parts go where actually because I don't have. Or you know what? We can just next time we meet up, we just gonna brainstorm, 100%. Just see what parts maybe fit where, and then we can compare if we were right or we miss out totally. But uh, I think uh, this one is rather uh, smart of me to figure it out. That's that not the banner. Yes, anyway, thank you for watching today. And uh, try to have some fun tomorrow as well. Uh, come join my channel. Uh, hit the like button and push the little ding dong bell. There, somewhere down the corner. As every goddamn YouTuber says, because it's all about the clicking. God damn it. Okay, anyway, have nice, have, have fun. Stay glued and stay safe. And remember to pit. Put your things away from your children at home. I do it like this, so it gives me another seconds before they do like this and stab themselves. Uh, so we're gonna put this on and we're gonna put them real up high on the shelf. See you next time. Have a nice day. Just gonna put the camera off here. <laughs>